on Elsa's channel. Whoa, guys, welcome. Hello and welcome to the stream. My gosh. <laughs> oh, yeah, sorry. Sorry, introvert Lantina. The, uh, the, the Nightbot gets a mad at uh, the amount of emotes. <laughs> Much love. Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, adventurers and legends. I want to welcome you to the stream. Uh, this is an art stream. It's a special, special stream today. Um, basically, what it is, is uh, I've got a, uh, a tiny commission from um, James Thorlikson, who um, uh, I guess saw some of the earlier streams and was very, very interested in getting their, uh, their pet done today. So that's what we're going to be doing. Um, it is, uh, I guess, what they call a mouse Oh my gosh. Thank you for all the raids and, and, and all that. Welcome. My goodness. I guess I, I went live at the right time. <laughs> um, just doing a sound check here, making sure that you guys can hear me. It uh, looks like the audio is working fine. I think I got a thumbs up. Um, and yes, uh, uh, Marco. Uh, uh, yes, I am on a lot of uh, streaming apps, um, including a new one uh, that's in beta format called Kick. Uh, Definitely uh, for the giveaway today, if you go to kick.com slash Elfsar and you, you start following me on there, you um, your your entries will be double. That's right. I'm going to give two entries for every entry on kick. Um, yeah, we're, we're building up our, our viewership there and uh, we're 20 follows away from becoming an affiliate on that platform. So uh, we're, 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 we're getting close. We're getting close. Guys, welcome to the stream. Ah, okay. Um, so the, the dog's name that we're doing today, is the name is Pina. Now, Pina is Spanish for pineapple. <laughs> um, so I figured let's put on some Spanish music, shall we? Uh, for our theme today. I got to make sure that this is working. Uh, if it's loud enough, that's the question. Can you guys hear music? Uh, give me a thumbs up if you uh, if if you if you hear some tunes. If not, I need to adjust my settings. Um, all right, so let's get this started, Joe. I grab my little protective mat. I know I tend to be pretty loud on the mic, so I I, I sometimes drown out the music. I apologize. I need to. I need to use a softer voice for these art streams. Um, I'm so used to in the gaming streams screaming a lot. So, <laughs> so what I've done is I put out down a, a protective mat, and what that what that does is allows me to, to protect uh, the tabletop, so to speak. Um, so Pina is a is a now here it is kind of a, a bit of um, a challenge because not only is it a challenge to photograph uh black dogs but it's also a challenge to draw them um and it's kind of like you want to challenge an artist you tell them to you know draw a, a draw a snowman in the snowstorm you know on white paper using nothing but white paint like that that it, it, it's just one of those things that's kind of it's really really difficult um and so that's kind of the challenge today the challenge today is to draw a black dog um we're gonna do that on black paper <laughs> I figured, why not, right? Like, let's, um, so what I've got basically here, this is just a pencil, it's just a pencil. It looks fancy, but it's it's not really. What it is is usually this this pencil is done for architectural design. Um, it's got a very, very uh, long, long nib. Um, and then I've got a, what they call a kneaded, er well, very used kneaded eraser. Um, you probably see these in, you know, drawing stores, art stores, that kind of thing. It's just basically a, 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 a gray, gray eraser that you could need and this one's so bloody used that it's actually disintegrating i might have to get a new one <laughs> um but yeah what it is is that you need the eraser and it will erase um uh, you know it's great for shaping you know it's almost like city of silly putty right you can shape and then actually erase and you know create different angles and stuff like that um it's really really useful for drawing and stuff like that i also you know tend to fidget with it and so i move it around in my hand a lot <laughs> um, yeah, they're great for graphite. They're great for charcoal. They're great for Conte. Um, and they're reusable. That's why, that's why it's almost like 
like silly putty, right? You just move it around and it will eventually absorb all the powder um, and whatnot. So anyway, let's begin. Uh, ah, okay. <laughs> Drawing a dog. Um, so black, black. So it, it, it's kind of a, um, it's a mixed breed, right? A terrier. It doesn't erase every... Well, I mean, it does a good job. It does a really good job. It takes a lot of it off. It depends on how deep stuff subs in the paper. Like, you know, pen marks, it's not going to do anything with. Um, it's mainly for picking up powder, right? Um, it does a pretty good job. Pretty good job getting everything. So. Um, okay, so I'm going to just and some marks here. I know it's hard. Usually this this point of the the, the very beginning is very difficult, right? Because it's very hard for you guys to see what I'm kind of sketching out. Let me see. Hello, hello. Welcome to the stream. Uh, Mr. Oddball, welcome. I don't think I've seen you here before. <laughs> How you doing? So, yeah, so what it is, basically, I do a giveaway uh, every stream, every art stream. Um, and so, but these art streams have been a little bit different. When I've got a, a commission, what I'm going to be doing is I'm going to be doing two drawings of the same subject. I'm going to let the, um, the, uh, I'm going, I'm going to be uh, letting the, sorry, I'm going to be letting the, um, the person that commissioned the drawing be able to pick which one they want. And then the one that they they you know they get first dibs right, and then the 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 one that's left over is going to be given away today um, on stream. Um, how we do that is uh, all you to get an entry. All you have to do is be in the channel on one of the various platforms during the time when I call out the um, the uh, the drawing. And we do it via a, a battle royale elimination wheel. So what that is, is I bring up a wheel, list of names, like so. Um, and we spin it and spin it and spin it until we get down to one winner. So Battle Royale style. Um, the way you can get additional entries is if you're a sub to the channel, of course, that gu guarantees you an entry. If you're on kick.com, we're featuring that this week. Um, it's worth double. Also, also, uh, I do have a Patreon. Patreon has uh, some other perks. Um, that you can actually get more entries. Now, the advantage of being a sub and the advantage of Patreon is you do not even have to be in the channel to um, to have an entry to win. Uh, however, if you are here, it only, as we proved last week, it only takes one entry to win. Um, we had a very big surprising winner uh, last week that had one entry on, the, on and just completely took the, took the whole thing. So, um, <laughs> anyways, let's... Uh, Let's let's continue. The whole point for, is for you guys to kind of enjoy um, a little, you know, yeah, that Bob Ross kind of feel. Um, I'm by no means comparing myself to Bob Ross, but uh, I'm, uh, you know, we're just here to chill. We're just here to chill. And um, I'm going to be using a, a whole bunch of different mediums here. Um, where are we going to start with? I, You know what I'm going to start with? I, let's do something different. I'm going to grab... So... I've got something called Conte. Now, what Conte is, is it's like compressed charcoal. Um, it's a much finer powder, so it sinks kind of deeper into the paper. Um, let's, let's start with a start with a white. Now, now some of these are broken, and but they're still usable. So, um, so what I'm going to do? I've got this black paper here. I've kind of outlined. I'm going to be doing kind of a profile shot. Yeah, that's true, Stephanie. You won. I think it was the first time you were on the channel, too, which was like super, super, uh, super cool. Um, sometimes it just works out like that, right? All right. Yeah, it's um, so. If you've never seen an art stream before, it's it's pretty much 
it's pretty chill. I mean, it's basically I try to put on some music. I try to talk to you guys. Uh, it gives you an opportunity to kind of get to know me, um, kind of what I'm, what I'm all about. And, uh, you know, we just uh, also greet each other in chat as well. Like, it's kind of the whole purpose of this, right? Um, so the story is when I started doing um, art streams, it was honestly, it was kind of like, it was, it was kind of a, um, a really, uh, so what it is, is I, I became an affiliate. First platform I ever got associated with was a platform called DLive. And uh, I was, I was an affiliate there and we had an affiliate party stream and I wanted to do something special for that party stream. And I did, I was racking my brain. I didn't know what to do. Um, Cause what I did, what I streamed was I played video games. And um, I, uh, I was trying to brainstorm ideas of what to do, something different, something cool. Um, and I, uh, I was, I was uh, a big fan of, there was a, a channel on DLive um, by a guy that uh, was known as the coin captain. And he did uh, coin streams, uh, which I thought was really cool. So he set up an upper camera like I have here and he would show, he would go through coins and his whole, whole thing was looking for silver, um, you know, cause silver was worth a lot. And so if you got uh, uh, silver dollars mixed in with 50 cent rolls, um, you would actually turn a profit. And so it would be coin hunting essentially. Um, and that's what, what he was doing. And I thought it was really neat. I thought it was different than a lot of what everyone else was doing. And I was like, well, what can I do? And I'm like, well, I can draw. Um, you know, I have a background in art. And uh, I thought, well, wouldn't it be cool if I could sketch live on stream? And um, it was... <laughs> it. It was the most nervous thing I've ever done because I had never drawn live on stream before. And uh, I was I was incredibly nervous about it. But I, I, I did three drawings that day. Uh, we did three giveaways plus a bonus giveaway. And uh, the reception was was. Uh, I was so humbled by it. it. There was a lot of people that really loved to see it. And that's kind of what we've done ever since. Every week we've done giveaways. Uh, we've done. Uh, an art stream. Um, we've done it, you know, sometimes I've done more than one art stream a week. Um, I haven't done that recently because I've been, I've been working and stuff like that. So I don't have a lot of time, but, um, but yeah, it's been, uh, it's been a really, really fun experience. So what I've done here is I've added a Conte as kind of like my, my background, so to speak. So this is kind of like the silhouette shape of where the, the dog face is going to be. Um, Roughly, I guess. I don't know. <laughs> uh, I'm just, I'm just rubbing, rubbing as much of the excess powder off because it can get quite messy. Um, kind of shape some of this, some of this out too. I think. Kind of figure out where where it's going. Um, okay, cool. So we've got got kind of a, a roughness for the background. What I need to do is I need to start sculpting or where where everything's going. Um, give myself kind of a, a, you know, a guide, so to speak. Right. Hey. Ah, no, James. So base, I'm James. I'm going to uh, welcome to the stream, by the way. And and also thank you. Um, so for Pina, uh, your 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 adorable pooch. Uh, I'm going to be challenging you today because I'm going to be doing two drawings, James. And James, you're going to have an important decision to make. You're going to have to pick one of them of which one you want. And then the other is going to be given away on stream today. <laughs> so so uh, now you don't have to decide like right then and now. I can send you uh, the, the, the pictures of what they look like. And if you want to discuss it with your wife or whatever, um, you guys can decide together which one you'd like, or you can you can pick and uh, and and the other one will be given away uh, to a lucky viewer here on on the stream. Um, <laughs> but also, James, thank you for 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 coming to the stream. That's awesome. 
Um, so right now, what I'm doing is I'm doing a, a profile kind of uh, kind of shot, I think. So I'm just kind of what I'm doing is I'm just just kind of trying to sketch out what I want here. Um, just to give myself kind of an idea. Roughly. Oh, yay. Say if there's an eye there. Now, again, drawing, drawing, you know, b black dogs on black paper, not the easiest thing to do. Um, but we do like to challenge ourselves a bit. Okay. Just kind of roughly roughing it in. So what I'm doing right now is I'm just kind of looking at the, the characteristics of the of the dog and kind of capture, you know, because we're not going for hyper realism. We're going for we want to, you know, capture the likeness, right? A rough. Yes, it's a rough drawing. Ha. Ah, I see what you did there. <laughs> So, uh, James, I don't know if you wanted to share with us. Um, how did you guys come up with the name Pina? Because Pina is pineapple in Spanish. I mean, I guess, I mean, it's an adorable, adorable term, a pineapple. Let's see, roughly that. So I just used a, a bit of pen just to give myself a little bit of a guide. Um, let me see. Where is that? Where's that? Where's that piece? I'd have to refine that, that just a bit, just to kind of figure out how it's going. I might actually put it on. Um, it's lying down. <laughs> All right. Okay. So, what's my method of attack here? The first thing first is we need an eyeball, right? A lot of times you want to start with the eye because um, a lot, a lot of stuff is communicated through eyes and uh, you know, they say windows to the soul. It's um, you got to You, a lot of times with the drawings, you got to nail, nail the eye. You don't do that. You might as well just, you might as well get it out of the way, because if you don't, if you don't, if the eyes aren't nailed, you might as well start over. <laughs> so this is kind of like the upper brow. Um, 
the shape of the face. <clears throat> Excuse me. My goodness. I need to drink something. Hold on a second. <laughs> oh, a little hydration never hurts, right? Okay, so let's lay in. I got a little tester here, Paige, too, just so I can it's quite light. But I'll lay down a color. Oh, no problem, Stephanie. Awesome. Hopefully it goes well. So what this is um, using right here is a uh, paint marker. It's a paint pen by Flymax. So we're starting to, I'm getting the highlight of an, uh, of an eyeball. <laughs> I'm kind of debating on what I want to do in terms of mixed media here. Do I want to paint a little bit? So I'll, I'll give you a close up of what I've uh, what I've done so far. You can see like there's a little bit of an eyeball, <laughs> kind of peeking out. A lot of times, okay, so it's going to be highlighting fur and the direction that that fur is going to take um, is really the idea here of like really kind of controlling where where the hair is growing um, or spreading out to. And that's kind of what's going to really shape um, the picture. There's going to be elements of detail, um, but for the most part, it's going to be kind of figuring out which direction the hair goes. Okay, the kind of nose kind of comes down here. All right, so we're just kind of figuring it out. By me doing this too, it'll kind of creates the shape in my head as well as I can do re relationships, right? So what I'm looking for is I'm looking for the relationships between how much space there is between the eye, between different things like you would on, you know, with a nose, ears, mouth, and face. Um, the fur and the direction that that fur travels is kind of almost the same thing. So if you if you pay close attention to where the fur is is traveling, like where it's com coming from, the next piece you could relate to that, and therefore you're starting to get, ac you know, accuracy, right? You know, we're not our brains are not computers. Well, they are computers, but they're. <laughs> 
that you know we're not this is not going to be like the hyper hyper photorealistic um drawings this is just trying to capture or you know or what it is is it's i think what's cool about art is that it is how one individual sees the world um and tries to express it through the art right um and that's, I think, what makes art really fascinating, is that everybody sees things differently. Um, and I think that's kind of a... You know, that, that that's something about... That's, that's, I guess, unique to humans, right? Like, we... we um, the artistic expression is is so unique and so individual. Wow, a lot just came out. Wow. So my pen leaked a bit. I don't mind. I don't mind. I can link all at once. <laughs> I don't know why that happened, but it happened. What do we say on... Uh, what, is, oh, Bob, what does Bob Ross say? Happy little accents? Yeah, happy little accents. We meant to do that. And I think that's also one of the beauties about traditional work, right? Is that um, there is no undo button, right? Like it's that it, you know it becomes part that becomes part of the piece now. down here there's a bit of um is this like chest hair <laughs> i think so hey old death think thinker how you doing how is your uh midweek what do they call it hump day happy hump day happy uh international women's day as well. I heard I heard it was International Women's Day today. I I don't know how to feel about that. I'm I'm kind of I'm part of me is like, yes, definitely celebrate it. 100%. And then uh, the other part of me is like, well, that just seems silly cuz it's kind of like I don't think we should designate a day or a month you know as as you know, oh, you know, it's I guess it's 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 more homaging and, and honoring it. Um, I, it's the same thing of kind of like, I'm not a big, I'm not a big fan of like things like Black History Month, like where we just focus on, you know, something for a month and then the rest of the month or the rest of the year is not Black History Month. I don't, I, I, I've always had problems with, uh, with that kind of thing. I think it should be kind of, um, I believe in, yeah, celebrating it hundred percent, but it's. Part of me is like, also, it just, it, it kind of um, diminishes the value for the rest of the year. How's that? Yeah. The only holidays that count is ones that you get off from work. <laughs> <That's>, <laughs> if it's not a statutory holiday, doesn't doesn't count. <laughs> <laughs> kind of cold but true <laughs> uh i'm you know i i don't know i i've i've just been um i oh you get paid extra nice that's uh that, that's what they call a paid holiday <laughs> those are the best kind of holidays 100 <laughs> percent Okay. <laughs> oh, let's see. Do I have a darker pen? 
because that would be very useful. A thick one would be really nice. Uh, Stephanie, I'm with you on that. Um, as an African American uh, disabled veteran woman, yes, I, I'm, I've been always an adamant of like I don't believe, like I believe in everybody being treated equally, and it's kind of like to do special holidays for one group or another or whatever. It doesn't make sense to me. I it just it's 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 emphasizing segregation. It's emphasizing that you know like separateness. Um, I believe in you know, you know, cultural, you know, honoring and 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 whatnot. But I don't think I don't know. I just I've always had qualms with it. I mean, I, I don't know what the right thing to do is, but um, regardless, I would like to celebrate um, all the women out there, hundred uh, percent. Let me. Let me. I need paint. We're gonna grab some paint. Uh, yeah, we started with the eye. We started with the eye because because it's like I need a center point for you guys to be able to see what's going on, <laughs> and at the same time, it's really important to nail the eye right right away. Um, we're gonna we're not done with the eye yet. We're gonna add some more stuff to it, but it's but the essence is there, so that's that's good. Um, I'm gonna add some black paint to my palette. <laughs> there you go. She does think her nose. Death think Death think you're smarter than the average guy here. <laughs> uh 100%. I I like for me, uh Superstar is my everything, right? Like she's she's um I don't know, I would be completely lost without her. Um the the effect that she's had on my life and my being and like who I am. Is, uh, she's so wrapped up in it that like it's I, I I don't even I wouldn't even recognize myself without her. Um, so so I mean put it this way guys, I put her name is in my channel like it's I, I'm Elf she's Sar right like it's like that's how much of a, a, a part of her she is to me. So <laughs> I would love to have her more on the channel um, of course, but it's just not um, not feasible. But uh, we're working on ways to, to try to incorporate a little bit more. Um, I have a, a poll up right now of co-op streams, and I know that um, she'd be interested in, in playing some of those co-op streams. So um, if you haven't already voted, I know some of you already have, but if you haven't voted yet, uh, definitely go. Up. It's on my Twitter and on my Discord uh, is where you can find the link. Um, and it's where you can vote what single player game we play as well as um, co-op co adventures we're going to jump into. Um, all right. So I'm just, I'm, what I'm doing right now is I'm just laying in some black tones because in order to put light down, um, we need looks like a bunny. <laughs> yeah, I get. Well, I mean, these these uh, this is a, a, a like a terrier breed cross with a um, a Maltese, I believe. Um, and it's 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 black with like a lot of white patches. So. All right. Uh, well, I've got, I've got, um, so a lot of times with portraits, um, especially with like commission portraits and stuff like that, it's, it is, um, the high number of photographs is, is ultimately very necessary because, um, I have to understand what the subject is that I'm looking at. And when I can't, when it's not a live model, um, it becomes, I'm dependent on those photographs, right? Um, so the photographs that are, are given to me are helping me kind of determine what what the shape of, of, of stuff is, you know, what good lighting 
reflections, that kind of thing. Um, but at the at the end of the day, too, also, you know, if I get really pixelated and fuzzy photographs, I can't do much with it. Like it, I can. So so the better the photographs I get, the more detail I can see, and therefore a lot of times the drawing comes out a lot better. So. Um, but I mean, there is ways of. Again, you're trying to produce a feeling. You're not necessarily trying to do photorealistic, right? Um, ultimately, I mean, yeah, you want it to look like a dog and you want it to look at the characteristics of the, uh, the portrait you're doing. But so here, OK, so I'm going to do a little bit more dark on the neck, I think. Uh, what if you send two, like, uh, like someone in their doppelganger? That would really be a night challenge, actually, because it would be like, okay, if you know, people, two people that look the same might have still have, there's a slight different vibe with them, right? Or a feeling. So it'd be quite the challenge to actually go, you know, let's try to capture that feeling um, and the difference between those two people. That's a super challenge. Holy crap. Has anybody ever done that? I wonder. I mean, twins. Twins is is a great example, right? T twins are often they look the same, but they're very different people. So yeah, hmm, something to think about. Okay, and have kind of random hair. Coming out. Fuzzy monsters. Okay. Just gonna move that over there like that. Let's grab a little bit more water, stick it in our palette. I need to get a, I need to get myself a smaller brush. That's a nice yeah, we want a nose that goes down all the way. All the way down. Like so. Oh yeah, I guess I guess yeah, that would be that would be confusing, right? It'd be like two different two different people molded together. An amalgam <laughs> of of the two. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, I imagine, right? You you So for those that don't know, Deathfinger does um a lot of uh miniature uh paintings live on stream. Definitely check out his channel. He's um, you know, see, he's got, he's got, he's probably, he's probably, hey, he's probably got a lot more um, painting materials than I do. <laughs> I've, I've, I've got some basic stuff. Um, most of my my paints have uh, have dried up. I actually went into my old art supplies and took a look, and most of them are completely. <laughs> so I'm like, okay. That's the thing about acrylics, right? They dry out. I, you know, you know what, Death Thinker? I used to paint miniatures, um, like way back. We're talking like 20 years ago, um, back when you know Warhammer 40k first came out. Um, and so I, I have a bunch of miniature, um, uh. Painted miniatures that I've done. I should probably show them on stream at some point. Um, and uh, I have some paints and stuff I got from that back then, and they're all like they're all dead. <laughs> uh, when did I start painting? Well, I can't really. I don't even remember. I mean, I think it was in preschool, probably. Um, I might. My uh, my parents were pretty encouraging. Um, 
my father was kind of my father was kind of a um well he's 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 a painter um and um he was the type of guy that like when i was like really really young he would like give me crayons and say there's the wall go to town like he he i was in my room and he's like that go ahead and uh and draw to your heart's content um he really like he wanted me to to just embrace art um and i did do that and there was actually a funny story cuz like um there was there was a i can't remember if it was a babysitter or whatever but they um they <laughs> they i guess they saw all the drawings on the wall and stuff like that and they spent all evening or something like that cleaning it um, and I think my father came home and he was furious because he wanted to take a picture of it. <laughs> and he was so upset <laughs> that it all got cleaned up. <laughs> I don't remember any of it. I'm just, I'm just saying hearsay stories. Oh, that's right. Death Figure's doing a Beholder. Um, always been a, a fan favorite of ours. Of, uh, some D&D &D monsters. All right, laid in some 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 blocks. Nice. Let's um let's just clean our brush. And I'm thinking of oh, you know what? Let's do. Let's be silly. Let's um. Let's grab some white paint. Let's do something where we have like a I gotta I gotta think of how I'm gonna do this. So one of the like like I've said on, on previous streams, one of the things uh our biggest criticisms I get is that most painters um believe that I'm I I'm draw with paint i don't paint with paint. and I, it's been a hard struggle for me to something like that to overcome um where I, to let the paint strokes kind of do most of the talking and i don't know what it is it's 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 something that i i you know to let the paint strokes be visible is really what painting is all about. Um, and I tend to overblend. I tend to want to um, not cover it up, but just, I don't know. So I'm in, I, part of me is kind of like, I need to let go. And let it um, let it be what it wants to be, right? So, I'm a mess. Much love. Thank you. Welcome to the stream. Yeah, it's kind of it's kind of a. Um, I don't know. I, I, it's, it's old habits, maybe. I don't know. It's a, it's, I need to just kind of let, there's beauty in breaststrokes. So let it be. I don't know. I've got to resist the urge to completely blend everything out. I don't know. <laughs> okay, I got to figure out where the light's going to be here. Cause what, uh, it's great and all. So uh, what? Okay. So what I'm trying to do is I'm trying to communicate. The head is lying down. It should be brighter here. I'll put a shadow on 
on this, and that will really help. So where it needs to be tight is where the head hits the sheet. So probably what I'll do is I'll just go a little bit uh, lighter here, and that will that will that will create the illusion of pressure. Miniature paint, I guess it would be easy, like a 3D coloring book. Freehand paint is hard. Um, well, yeah, I mean, I, I guess the thing about miniatures is that they're sculptures, right? And painting a sculpted surface is going to have naturally already the crevices and the high points or highlights already, uh, I guess, um, dictated for you. All right. Well, I, if James is happy, I'm happy because <laughs> James, James, this is James's dog. So. <laughs> so my challenge, sir, though, is I'm the next one is supposed to top this one, right? <laughs> that's that's the whole idea. But you know what? That's the thing about art, right? Like sometimes it's an easy choice. Sometimes it's like, you know, nope, that's the one I want. Uh, Julie's got some advice. <laughs> uh, everyone has to give control over at some point. I uh, remember painting layers is not so much blending. Just to keep in mind, yeah. <laughs> At the same time, I don't want I don't want to get the, the page too wet. I'm trying to create a little bit of a highlight or something like that there. Right. Okay. I'm happy with that. All right, sounds good. Try to resist blending that out. I'm just gonna wash my brush a bit. Okay. Now, what do we do? What do we do? It's a blender. I don't want to use a blender. What do I want to use? Decisions, decisions. This is, is this Conte? This is Conte. Okay. Okay. A bit hard. It's a hard Conte. Well, we'll see. We'll see. Is this dry enough to lay my hand on it? Probably not. <laughs> Let me use a napkin. Just in case. So what I've done now is I'm switching back to a, like a, a Conte, um, kind of almost like a pencil crayon, right? I'm going back into the hair here. Also, I'm trying to provide a little bit of a texture. Because there's one thing about smoothing a whole background out, but at the same time, you need you need a, you need that um, texture. Uh, texture adds a lot uh, because it, it's a lot more information for the eye to see, um, and it's useful on you know, not only just art but also like even costume design, right? You ever noticed like any of the, the modern day superhero costumes out there that they have patterns built into them? A lot of times there's like little little things on the on the costume that would normally be like just a blue or red or whatever, but there's like little surfaces um, because it's important for the eye to to keep busy. 
All right. This is the nose, so I'm adding a little bit of a, a texture as well to this. Different texture, right? A lot of times there's... The nose is such the most sensitive part of a dog. Makes sense that, um, let's see, how deep do I want to go here? I might actually go in with a paint pen afterwards. Um, on top, just to bring the whatever's the, the white surface forward. There's a lot, a lot more white um, on the very bottom, the chin here. So we might go back into that. I'm gonna see. I'm gonna do the rest of it first. See how it comes out. So we've got our deep, deep dark blacks in there. Now what I need to do is I need, just need to kind of. Bring forward some of this fur. Okay, what's happening here? It needs to be up. Yeah, I don't know if how much you guys like my camera is okay. I don't know how much of it picks up. Um, that's one of the things I really want to do a little bit of research on is finding finding out what are some better quality cameras out there. Right now, what, what I've got is 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 for me, it's you know, what I do, it's good enough, right? But how cool would it be to have like a really high definition camera? Or, or a magnifying component that I could actually like move over and like it would zoom in really close. Cause it's like, I can move the camera up and down constantly and try to go closer, but it is um, a bit cumbersome. And I end up drawing off the, I forget about that I'm on camera and I start drawing off over here, you know, down below, and you guys can't see it. And it's like, I look at some of my uh, videos later, and I'm like, man, I'm really bad at that. <laughs> I do want to make some more uh, time lapse videos as well. Um, I apologize that I've been a little bit light on that with the YouTube, but. Uh, use your cell phone and have a zoom and autofocus. Yeah, I guess phones nowadays, they're like, they're like some of the best cameras out there, right? You draw off to a draw off camera too. Uh, yeah, I, I forget. I, I, I'm constantly like yelling at myself at my, uh, at my past self constantly. <laughs> here happening I kind of like that thirty my 39 max pixels 39 pixels is the max really That's 
That seems that seems really low. I don't know why. Hmm. What kind what kind of phone is it? Is it a is it an iPhone? Oh, Meg. I'm like their 9 pixels is like nothing. <laughs> I'm like there's no way. But megabytes. Megabytes is different. Oh, no, all good. All good. Okay. All right. Okay, I'm happy with that. Okay. We've got some, the, some, some of the basics down here. Um... I do think what I'd like to do Aw oh, I'm sorry to hear that, Julia. Okay, we're what I'm gonna do is I'm going to So although the dog is uh, is black, it doesn't mean there's not other colors that I see in it. Um, so I'm just adding some of those some of those colors now. as well. You're having a smoothie, Elizabeth? shadow happening. Cool. 
Oh, you, oh, you stream, you, you were streaming having the, the smoothie? Sorry, I'm trying to grab colors here. Uh, it's a, that's a dark brown. Cool. Okay, I need a little bit more contrast. to the pen and this doesn't dry like this it does dry okay because I need to bring stuff forward right Oh, you're wearing something risque is what you meant. Oh, okay. If you're if you're happy in the dress, then by all means wear it. <laughs> wear what makes you happy. So the reason why I'm adding a little bit of darkness here is I want to go in with a lighter, lighter, lighter paint on top of it, and it will be a little bit more striking. But in order for it to pop out, I need, need something to, for it to pop out against. Um, so that's why I'm kind of laying this on top. So again, with color colors and stuff like that, colors will change depending on the next color you put next to it, right? So um, that's why this thing's like color color theory and all that. Whoa, who plays? My gosh. Thank you for that lovely host. I hope you I hope your games went well. <laughs> Appreciate that, my friend. <laughs> A woo raid, Daryl! Welcome to the stream. How you doing? <laughs> Gio, Gio Amy! Much love. Appreciate it. I don't I don't get a lot a lot of action on, on Trovo, so it's 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 always great to see new people. Thank you. What was Wu playing? What was was Wu playing Fortnite? Was he playing Fortnite? Was he doing a battle royale? <laughs> right on, right on, right on. De oh, Dead by Daylight. He was playing some Dead by Daylight. Ah, so is is Wu is Wu um. Much of a screamer. Does he scream a lot? <laughs> Aw, thank you for greeting him, guys. I let you live. <laughs> you got killed by friends. Oh, no. Oh, somebody let you live. <laughs> oh, that's fun. Were you doing like a stream day with viewers? Hey, dude. Oh, thank you so much. I can't not kill you. <laughs> oh, that's got to be a lot, lot of lot of lot of fun. Thank you so much for the sub. I I like honestly, thank you. That's that's super kind. 
Aww. Uh, for those that are wondering, I'm doing a drawing uh, for James Thorlickson uh, from YouTube. And uh, yeah, so I'm doing one of two drawings. Uh, what I do on my art streams is I do my own kind of battle royale, which is basically I will spin the wheel, get down to one name, and then one person walks away with a drawing. However, because of the special case that um, this is this is someone else's dog, they get first dibs, they get first pick, they pick which one they want, and then whatever was left over goes goes out for free to a to a, to another lucky viewer. Now there is the possibility they can win both if they're here in the channel and and and. Uh, Jump in uh, on the giveaway. Um, we've proven that all you need is one entry, and you can you can walk away with the whole thing. So uh, there's always the chance that he can get both drawings, but uh, he would he would need to uh, enter in uh, when it's called for. <laughs> so uh, it's mixed media. It's a mix of paint, Conte, uh, pen and ink. Um, yeah, it's and primarily I spend about two hours per drawing. So, uh, what are we at right now? We're about an hour in. <laughs> so. Yeah, there's going to be a little bit more detail work put in this in the in this drawing actually. All right. So what I was doing was I'm putting in some darks here and then I was going to put in some lights on top of it to try to bring that forward. Um we might be able to actually get some of the hair really really look like it's floating above the other one. <laughs> Mother of Dragons, welcome. <laughs> uh, so the reason why we're playing some Spanish guitar is the name of this dog is named Pina. And um, yeah, you'll find dragons are pretty something that's very special on our channel here. I <laughs> oh, appreciate that. Um yeah, we've 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 always we've always uh, loved dragons. So, four twenty pickle Rick, <laughs> Pikachu. <laughs> that links up to here. Okay. Oh, 100% woo plays. I listen. I I know how it is. Uh, when you host someone, you want to you, you you gotta get off and do do other things. Uh, much love. Thank you so much for the raid. I really appreciate it. Honestly, thank you so much. Uh, what is special? Oh, dragons. Dragons are special. Yeah. Okay. Pretty happy with how that's kind of come out. We, we need to have a little bit more definition happening up here. Uh, you can you can see you just uh, can't have people looking over your shoulder uh, to speak. So I zone out. Oh, like you mean for for doing art? Love from Trova today. Wow. You know, that's that's the whole thing that that never it never ceases to amaze me 
uh, I'm uh, I'm forever just humbled by like they're just amazing people out there that you meet, you know, and it just that's one thing I've I've uh, if someone asked me from you know my my previous self, you know what what I thought about streaming and what what I thought streaming was and what what it meant, I'd be completely different answers now. Like just the um the, the the amount of people I've I've met through just doing this has been so like amazing. It's just I I it's hard to, it's hard really hard to put it in words actually. Um It's it's kind of a uh it, it, like it's kind of, it's I don't know what it, it's like you can't you can't really explain it until you've experienced it maybe I don't know um I just blown away blown away okay so trying to you know what I'm trying to do is I'm trying to add a little bit of a highlight kind of going up the side of the face I kind of think I need to black I need to go darker there to be quite honest let's grab a black contact it tends to gray out a bit um so it's not black but it's it's more of a gray Uh, for those that are wondering too, I, I do hit the drawings with a uh, workable fixative. Uh, what that does is it puts a clear coat on the drawing um, and seals it so it won't smudge on your fingers when handling it and whatnot. Um, and that way it's ready for framing. Um, you know, so the frame can even have glass and it won't it won't uh, won't spread to the glass. It protects it. It's, it, it, it I tell you, though, to apply it, it's smelly stuff. <laughs> so if you're ever using workable fixative, make sure you're in a ventilated area. <laughs> um, so, OK, here's here's a here's a trick too. Uh, the poor man's uh, fixative. Um, if you if you're if you're out of fixative and you really need and you're in a jam and you need to, to seal something up, another alternative way that you could use is just grab um, uh, some hairspray hairspray works wonders it puts that it puts a coat on it the only downside about hairspray is that it will sometimes darken the drawing um, the drawing gets a little bit darker um, than you may have intended so that's that's the that's the downside of not using uh working using the fixative uh, I need my music thank you so I, uh, I was asking uh, James what he, um, how he came up with the the name Pina, but uh, I didn't get a, I didn't get an answer. So uh, that will have to remain a mystery. <laughs> Who knows? Maybe, maybe, maybe James is just a big fan of uh, pineapple pizza. I mean, I can, I can, I would say that that's a, a justifiable reason. Some people like pineapple, pineapple on pizza. Some people don't. Some people are, are freaked out by the idea of pineapple on a pizza. Um, but I've never actually tried it. And then that, that's a, at the same time, there can be pineapple pizza that's prepared really badly. And then there's, uh, there's also gourmet. <laughs> Hairspray makes it hurricane. <laughs>
a little bit more darkness here. So I'm going to do a little bit of cross hatching. Yeah, I know. I'm using my finger. I'm not supposed to. Hairspray makes hurricane proof. Oh, okay. I got, I was trying to figure out what you were trying to say. I was like, what? <laughs> hurricane proof. Yes. Your, your hair will be, be turned into a helmet, <laughs> right? What they call helmet head. So I'm trying to create a little bit of a shadow underneath the um, underneath the, that top le le layer of fur. I'm going to go in here with, here with a and on top. See what happens if I blend that in. Yep, liking it so far. Awesome. Okay. Now, what am I going to grab here? A lighter blue? Pablo, how was your midweek? How was your hump day? <laughs> I appreciate the lurk, friend. to see so many mods in the house. I can say that now about Pablo. <laughs> I'm doing alright. I'm doing alright. Okay. Let's see. Let me see here. Let me, um... more of a gray. Do I really? I don't know if I... Whoa! Pablo! Thank you, dude, for the... Elsa, I hope you like ice cream. Uh, what what do people one. call that? I've heard it on other channels. People people were saying uh, uncommon and the common drop combo is a bitch slap. <laughs> I appreciate that. Thank you. Thank you for the... Thank you for the... The double lemon combo. Yeah, this... Uh, this is, um... So this has been described that these dogs are kind of like one of, you know, a really good lap dog, right? Like they're really, they're very loyal. They're very um, great for families, great with children. Um, okay. And they're, um, yeah, they're, they're cute. They're cute. Cute critters. Let's see, I need to have like more of a black that kind of comes out like that. I'm trying to see how. So, by putting the blue on top, it actually adds a bit of a, you know, the moment of where it could be darker, right? I don't mind that. Eye, under, underneath the eye, should be darker as well.
So the whole idea, basically, I mean, I guess the difficulty where the difficulty arises is trying to provide that depth um, when it's mostly a black, black surface. Okay, we're going to go in with a lighter pen and try to do some of that, that lightness in the front. Um, actually, before I do that, before I do that, one more step. I'm going to grab a, a blue here. And I'm just going to put... Uh, I don't know. You know what? That might be too too dark, too chromatic. Um, chromatic meaning high in temperature, the temperature of the of the um, okay. I'm gonna do a little bit of blue. I think here. Oh, okay. Your uh, your daughter your daughter picked the name. So, so, so Amber must be a fan of pineapple pizza. <laughs> that's, that's, that's what that's what we're determining. She's a she's a um, she likes pineapples. Adding a little bit of blue, because that I need it to stand out from the from the white that we're gonna about to put on. Hopefully this pen cooperates with me today. I'm just gonna clean it first, and then we'll apply. That should be better. Shake it up. Pretty deliberate with how all these hairs flow. So that's going to bring th a lot of things forward. Now, last week's stream um, that we did of a uh, backup and stuff like that was, I just want to thank everybody um, that dropped by or, or, or uh, checked it out later. Um, it was, it was a pretty hard stream for me, um, but I think important and at the end of the day, very therapeutic for me in a way. I did have kind of a bit of an emotional moment, especially towards the end, so. It looks lifelike. Woo. Well, I'm, I'm very happy that it, I'm not drawing what looks like to be a dead dog. <laughs> I'm joking. Calm down. That's awesome. Thank you. <laughs> How are you, man? It's, um, 
Sea of Thieves week, isn't it? That means tomorrow there's a Sea of Thieves stream. I know uh, Season 9 isn't coming out until March 16th. But that doesn't mean we can't uh, get into... Um, into some, some, some trouble, some fun. <laughs> some quiplash. Yes. We gotta figure out what we're gonna do. <laughs> we gotta figure out what, what adventure we're gonna go on. And uh also whose ship we're gonna take. Because are we are we uh we're taking turns, aren't we? For the each ship. I know um Awesome probably regretted taking out his ship last week. <laughs> we damaged every single component of that ship was damaged by the end of the stream. <laughs> Alright. Get some get some big whiskers. I gotta let that dry a bit. Pina. Pina is a, um, it's, uh, I guess, pineapple in Spanish, so. <laughs> it's their little pineapple. to create that glossiness on the eye, right? It just kind of needs to be a little bit of a sparkle. So it's a, an incredible honor to do someone's, you know, personal dog. I think that's so I do want to thank everyone. Also, if anybody out there is, uh, I'm going to need content for next week. Um, if anybody out there would like to get their pet done, uh, contact me, my about section, um, either email, Twitter, Discord, whatever. Um, We've been we're, we're spending the you know a, a few weeks just um I, I've noticed that I've I've started doing themes right so we'll do a theme for a little bit and then uh, I'll I'll do another theme and it's also it tries to make sense for the channel um you know especially like the YouTube channel is a bit of a mishmash of a channel right. <laughs> Uh, Johnny Fife says, not taking my ship. <laughs> oh, much love. Uh, and Dr. Jonathan MD that looks really cool. Oh, thank you guys on kick. Uh, appreciate it. Apologies that I didn't respond right away. Still working out the, the details and the, and I'm going to get my alerts running up there as well. Um, lot, little, still a little bit of more work to do. But appreciate the uh, appreciate the follows, guys. I'll uh, I'll make sure to hit you back if you're um, if you if you're streaming on Kick. I think if, I think that anybody that's on Kick is probably a streamer. <laughs> I'm guessing. <laughs> I don't know how much of an audience. Oh, that's not. I won't say that. 
I won't say that. There are there are people that that enjoy content that don't stream themselves. Uh, Pablo says, I have a canoe and a rubber ducky. No ship as of yet. No, your ship has sailed. <laughs> okay. Like, like in the way that's going. Like in the way that's going. Um, a little bit of a highlight here, maybe. I don't know. I don't want to smear it too much, so. Oh, your ship hasn't come in yet? Yeah. I think that could, uh, that could, a lot of people could probably identify with that. Like, I know I'm going somewhere. I just don't know where yet. Sometimes it's not about the destination, though, right? It's about the journey. That's the that's the thing that those are those life lessons that you um, that you learn. Uh, I guess as as you get older, right? Okay. Yeah, a little bit more random. Sometimes, sometimes I get a little bit too fussy, a little too fussy. Oh, thanks, James. How are we doing time-wise? Doing good, We're doing good. Again, I apologize in advance, James, just in case. Um, I mean, we'll, we'll establish this as our base. The next drawing uh, may may uh, be better, may not be better. What, I, I don't know yet, <laughs> so we'll see. That's again part of the journey. But I, if if you're as long as you're happy and you're you're liking this the way this one's coming out, then I'm happy. So. <laughs> Detail work. The important thing is, you know, if as long as we captured like the essence, you know, when if you if you look at the drawing and you think of Pina, then I've done my job. Perfect, perfect. Okay. A little bit more of a line here around the, the nose.
add a little bit more up the front. kind of feel like there needs to be something here now that I'm looking at it. I know we don't have a lot of time left, but there's something I want to change here. Possibly. Let's do it upside down. Uh, you know what? We're going to be subtle with it, I think. I think what we'll... Sun shining on her face? So it's to be like a like there's a pillow. Completely changes the whole thing, right? hatching and for the background. I just want this to be the high like highlight point. Pablo's been behaving pretty well. <laughs> I don't I don't know. Slowly, slowly been working, working up on it. It's um, I know my light is shining on it, right? So it's difficult for you to behaving. It's overrated. <laughs> Uh, 
Okay, let's add a little bit to the eye. Nice and flat spot too. I need the kind of a subtle shadow. bit more softness to the eye. <laughs> yep. Yep. Pablo Pablo had to say it. Close. We're getting close. It's almost done. <laughs> yeah, they, did I did I nail the eyes? That's important. Good, good, good. Like we said earlier, like the, the eyes are so important to, to get right. Nicely, actually. Let's see. And one thing I can say is, uh, I at least grabbed some pretzel crowns this time around. The last time I realized after the stream that I hadn't even brought any pretzel crowns into the backup drawings. Um, and I normally, it's my go-to, it's normally add a finishing touch, and I just, I didn't bring out the pencil crowns last time. Um, uh, why do I use pencil crowns a lot? Just because it's my, um... I don't want to say signature, but I just I, what I've got a lot of experience with is drawing, right? So, um, now when it's uh, like you know, especially when doing color drawings, it tends to you can do different layers and works out pretty well. Um, I mean, one could say, well, isn't this pretty much black and white? Yeah, you you wouldn't be you wouldn't be wrong. Um, it is. There, but there's more color in there than you realize. Uh, unfortunately, with the stream, it doesn't it doesn't um, show the color a hundred percent. You get hints of it, but there's a lot more color in the drawing than you think. Yeah, I think um, we've uh, pretty much nailed our first drawing of Pina. Um, there might be a little bit of hairs that I can do here. Up 
time is supposed to be a little bit out of focus. Um, I want more defined shape. Hold on a second. One second. We're not done just yet. I want I want it to, to look very purposeful. Dog knew and numbered your bottoms? Oh no. I guess that's, that's the terrier part, right? The terrier part of the breed. Uh, I'll, I, I'll be I'll be lying if I didn't say that uh, Georgia and Millie um, took some casualties of war with them. <laughs> I have a couple pairs of socks that have holes in them. <laughs> All right. Well, I think I think that uh, that pretty much nails our first drawing. Awesome. 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 But we're not we're not stopping right there. We are doing a second drawing. So the challenge now has shifted. I got to do a drawing that's better than this one. <laughs> right? Alright, give me a second, just clean my hands. I was going to mark up the other drawing unintentionally. There we go. Wipe that down. Perfect. Okay. So. Let me get a new picture of reference. All right, stick that one aside. We gotta level up on the channel. Why am I not hearing it? Apologies, I couldn't hear it, um, but I think it was... Well, you guys were able to hear it, though, right? For some reason, OBS did not uh, put it in my ears. Kind of quiet. Okay. Hmm. I mean, that particular interactive is actually very quiet. Believe it or not, it, it's not a very high. It wasn't recorded at a very high volume. Um. Sixteen thousand. You're not gonna run out anytime soon, my friend. <laughs> Um, oh, that reminds me. Uh, on kick. I <laughs> oh, appreciate that, Nai Nai. Thank you so much. <laughs> um, 
on kick, uh, I've actually added a babble bot. Um, so we now have dice rolls on kick. Uh, you could actually go uh, exclamation. I think it's roll 20 and it will um, it will pop a, uh, a dice roll. see if we can um nail down the eyes here I think these in terms of shapes. Mm -hmm. Okay. Let me just quickly grab this. Oh my gosh, guys. We're, we're at 58, 58 followers on kick. We only need uh, 17 more, 17 more guys. Appreciate it. So this is gonna be the focal point where the hair comes out. There's gonna be a little mouth here. out like that. We're gonna try it. We're gonna try and get go even cuter, guys. We're gonna go cute. That's that's impressive, Pablo. You haven't gone live once yet, and you're at 19 followers already. My gosh, <laughs> that's insane. That's better than uh, than than my buddy GamerCam, who's uh, who has been streaming <laughs> there. problem James I appreciate I appreciate you it's I want to I just want to say uh, also thank you for watching the streams thank you whether it's videos afterwards or currently live um, your viewership helps me in ways you that you, you probably don't realize um, if you hit a, a thumbs up on the video that helps the channel if you uh, if you want like just the amount of watch time that you uh that you watch the channel it, it 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 all helps right my my ultimate goal there is to is to you know get to a thousand subscribers and then four thousand hours watched those are those are the those are the two um things that are are required to be able to actually uh, become start a partnership with uh youtube uh, so that's kind of like my ultimate end game goal I got to learn how to do things on my way there. So this is, uh, like I said, it's not about the end goal. It's about the, it's about the journey, right? So I appreciate it. Okay. Yeah, this is going to look cute. This is going to look cute. Then do something like that. that as well
<laughs> yeah, okay. Happy, happy. I penciled pretty much everything in, I think. Now I can start laying in I know it's hard for you guys to see, hard for you to see, but you can kind of see, you start seeing the face forming there, right? Um, okay, eyes, 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 eyes. What do I do? What do I do? Let's... Thinner pen, I think is the best way. Go. Elizabeth, you're knitting clo cloth. Sorry, sorry. Also, guys, I, I'm responding to sometimes messages are appearing on the on the sidebar here from all the different platforms. The only thing that's missing from there is kick. Um, so if I'm responding to something, I try to read it out on kick. I guess I should say Elizabeth on kick said I'm knitting a cloth <laughs> um, just because it's not included. Now, here I've got some great news, uh, possibly great news. Um, when I was getting my uh, YouTube chat fixed, uh, to showcase all the different platforms. Um, I was talking to someone on, on uh, Restream. And uh, they mentioned that they've been getting a lot of requests for uh, Kick to be included with Restream. Um, and so the powers that be are still deciding this. But there may be a glimmer of hope that Restream IO will actually be incorporating Kick as their as a as a new platform as part of their service so if that works out then our chat is going to be 100 percent integrated with um with all the platforms including kick um and i look forward to that um Because my I, one of my big things I do like is the cross communication. I do like everyone being able to see each other's chats and cross communicate. Doesn't matter what platform you're on. Okay, I need to figure out how I'm gonna do this. Let's do I, and then where's the highlight gonna be here? side same thing Some, let's throw in some color. Nice. 
use our little rub stick just to rub some of that in. It's almost, like, it's almost like the eyes are amber. It looks like. Sounds like I'm uh, eastbound. Three of five siblings are in Ontario. No flights are open till Tuesday. No airline is going to be. Oh, wow. Uh, Julie, are you you're expecting visitors? Well, you mentioned that you didn't have some good news, so I'm. I'm sad, sad to hear that. Mystic, hello, hello, how are you? Good to see ya. We did a, a, a drawing earlier. Show it to you here. This is the, the drawing we did of uh, Pina. Who's a, um, and then I'm doing a second one right now of the same, same dog. I also have a, hi a highlight to put on there, but at the same time, I need to work out. Yeah, oh, cure for babies, 100%. Yeah, very, like, some would argue, like, the perfect, per perfect kind of lap dog, right? out the direction the hair is going to go. Because it's so important, actually, with these things. Are you doing you're doing a doing a St. Patty's Day party? St. Patty's Day, St. Patty Day party. There might be a, a, a drink or two involved, right? <laughs> Julie, 
Julie, do you have a lot of uh, Irish in your family? Okay. With that. I know, it doesn't look like much yet. Doesn't look like much yet. darker tone to establish the darker tone here first. There we go. That's just how, uh, how dark is that we're going to get. This kind of this is where the ear is. So what I'm doing now is I'm just laying in some uh, some like ink black patches of where the darkest points of the drawing are, and then we'll fill in. Awesome. So St. Patty's Day is a pretty pretty big deal then. It's a big family gathering. Uh, planning a big party. It's an East Coast Irish funeral, wake, kitchen party. Not sure what they call it. All I have uh, called it was big. It's a big party. Um, my honey family is the first generation off the boat from Dublin. You would be second generation. I'm a French raised in a British family.
Yeah, I figured, I figured when you said it was unfortunate news that uh, it may, may be in a, a passing in the family, so my condolences, of course. Elsa, someone just subscribed to your channel. Whoa. How are you going to react? How? How? Carrie Kaken, my goodness. Hey, man, how are you? Much, much love, dude. How, how are you, man? Give me, I just need to open up my thing. There we go. Why is it not? Doing well, doing well. We are, uh... Perfect, okay. We're just working out uh, the next, next drawing of this little pupper. So what I'm doing is just laying in some, uh, some where all the darks are. Front of the nose would be right. It's usually in the front. <laughs> sometimes, sometimes my mouth and my brain don't work. Uh, or most times. So this is where, like, I'll have to put in some. Shading and stuff like that of where, where that's going. I'm wondering if how mouth should be bigger. Then this is I have to go in with a different one, I think. Okay. The other ear is behind here. That's where the other ear is gone. Tucked behind. Okay. And then this. It's cascading for... There's going to be a white patch happening here. So that's why I'm not marking it in black ink. And then this cascades up. All right. Let's move on to different gray. Uh, do you get a lot of arguing going on in the family? That's like, I think that's any any family, right? I, I think uh, any family uh, has has its own drama or <laughs> various different different things. Shout out to all the families out there. <laughs>
slowly building up to it. lighter now. Um, that's the same color, I think. Is the same color? Yep. Uh, let me crack into these. What I'm using is a, a, a um, brush pen from Tombow. Uh, I want to go a little bit lighter in my grays. That's a that's a dark one, I think. That's a fifty-five. Can never judge a pen by its um number. Okay, that's might be a little too light, but kind of skipping a step. Oh, you're one of the lucky ones, <laughs> Julia. Those families uh, tend to, yeah, get into silly bouts of uh, disagreements. <laughs> Welcome back, Elizabeth. upside down. So what we're slowly slowly doing is working our, our way up to some details. But it's important we lay kind of like this groundwork first.
Oh, yeah. War will do that to you, Julia. Holy cow. For sure. Makes you really embrace the present, for sure. Slowly, slowly do it. Are we getting there? Holy crap, Julia. You've got some good genes in your family. My goodness, your aunts are, are that old and still kicking. That's amazing. What's the secret? <laughs> Not fighting, I guess. <laughs> Less stress. That is some uh, some some serious years. Go to bed mad. That's a good one. Some good advice there.
<laughs> it's my uh my little sadistic side. Of uh, making people choose. Pick your favorite kid. <laughs> Do it. <laughs> I don't know. I, I like I like a world filled with choice. I think um, we can all use a little bit more choice in our lives. So I think I I think it's a good thing. I could have stopped at the first drawing, right? I do like, I, I like, I like having options in life. I'm sure everyone wants the freedom that they, you know, they richly deserve. And, and life is about making those hard decisions too, right? So, gotta look at it as a, as a positive thing, not a negative. <laughs> Be careful how much water I'm putting on the page because I don't want to riffle the page too much. Um, I gotta give ample time for it to soak up and dry a bit. Uh, but I like the direction it's going. It's going well. It's in my blender. Try a bit more. <laughs> okay, and Let's see what this effect is going to be like. Grab a tissue. a bit of soft focus I like that Looking good? All right.
Uh, okay. Okay, slowly working our way up there. Don't scold me. <laughs> oh, it's like the puppy dog eyes. Is that it? <laughs> oh, that's funny. So we're kind of doing two different types of portraits. One was a side face, side portrait, and the other one, this one's kind of more front, front on. I kind of want the direction of that to go a certain way, but. Okay. So obviously I haven't laid down any white yet. That will really make it a dynamics really pop, I think. Once we get that up there, um, just saying if they need to lay down anything else here, maybe a little bit for the nose. Might use a, a couple colors as well. I really like putting color in, in, the, in the art, um, especially when you're dealing with like, let's say just a black subject. I really quite like Adding, adding colors that, um, that seem to make sense once it's, once it's in there. So add a little bit of pink. And then we'll go back into it. Just want the subtlety there. All right. Cool. Okay. And then do that with a little blue. <laughs> Good to see you, Mystic Angel. How are you doing? I hope you're well. 
The snow started to melt a little bit here. Let's, let's let's have a base for contrast. I'm gonna throw in a highlight. Just to get the eyes linting as they as they would. Usually under the eye, there's always a, a bit of light. I mean, the portraits are supposed to do that, right? They're supposed to showcase the best, the best qualities. <laughs> At the same time, it's it's got to look like the person, right? So, or, or the the subject, I should say, a person. Not my same person. Um, I mean, they're like our kids, right? So it's easy to call them, see them as a person. Family. So that establishes a base. Okay, I just wanted to at least have like, how bright it's going to be. It's, this is going to be all white down here too. Um, I do need to go in with a pencil, I think. Conte. Should we do this thing with Conte? Conte's been underused. No, Julia, you're getting dumped on again. Uh, yeah, we had a small dumping here, about 30 centimeters, and then uh, it's but the weather's been warming up, so it's been melting, right? So I can't, I can't complain. So think about withdrawing fur and hair and stuff like that. It goes a direction, but it's not 100%. I'm going to throw a little bit of variance in there. Otherwise, it doesn't look real, right? Can't be, this. Can't be super perfect. Okay. 
So St. Patty's Day is March 17th, right? I believe so. Falls on a is it falls on a Friday this year? Sounds dangerous. <laughs> people getting up to uh, some good times. Nine days. St. Patty's Day, nine days, okay. Now I'm just putting a little bit of highlights for the, uh, the nose. Okay. Those eyebrows. Right. They're so expressive, the eyebrows sometimes. <laughs> Thanks, Danny. <laughs> De Marvel. Hey, good to see you. Sorry about that. I, Mister, I've been so encapsulated with the drawing. I'm completely like, pfft. see, they're on kick. Much love. <laughs> How you doing? Good to see you. Um, 
Yeah, it's gonna get easier once uh once Restream gets uh involved with Kick. We're hoping for it. All right. <laughs> Nani Nai Nai. <laughs> You're saying hail? Much love. there we're gonna do whiskers and then there'll be a front white part as well bit of a hydration. <laughs> uh, Deb Marvel is the one who did the uh, the Babble Bot on kick uh, that we've got currently there. size <laughs> does it work um does it work i know the roll works right huh is it not working Oh, interesting. Okay, so Oh, you know what, Dev Marvel? I I bet you that's the case. That's probably didn't mod the bot. Let me um 100%. Uh it would just be Babble Bot, right? You know what? I forgot that important step. <laughs> you know what? I forgot that important step. <laughs> okay, let me um Moderators, let's add the moderators as Baba Bot. Uh, it's just simply just Babble Bot, right? Or Babble Chat, sorry. Thank you. Babble Chat. Okay, it's been added as a mo as a as a mod. Let's go back to the Let's go back to the Okay. I'll try it again. No, it's not working. Huh. Oh no, it worked. I just typed it in wrong. My bad. <laughs> it's not a D20, it's a 20. Roll 20. There we go. Beautiful. Awesome. Now you guys can check your peepee -pee size. <laughs> Uh, much love. Yeah, silly me, I forgot to add that that step. <laughs> <laughs> 
to it. <laughs> there it goes. Awesome. Uh, Natty is glad to hear it. Been, re been relaxing since I've, since I've been here for the first time in months. Oh, that's good to hear. Natty, are you finding finding a good good home on kick? It's it's for me for me personally. It's it feels to me like D Live and Twitch combined. You know, I, and I I can foresee in the future a lot more things that I loved about D Live being incorporated into Kick, um, and taking some of the stuff that works with Twitch and applying it to D Live, and I think it's going to be a happy marriage. Um, so I I do find I think there's a lot of potential for Kick. Um, but it's still really early. Like, you know how long it takes to make these things? It's very, we're, we're still in the very beginning stages. Um, but I'm, but I have been seeing that a lot on kick that a lot of people seem to be a lot more hopeful, a lot more, um, optimistic about kind of their, their, their future for, with streaming. So, <laughs> It's a puffy face. It's a puffy face. <laughs> okay, I need to add. I need to add um, some of the the white whiskers up in the front. Okay. Uh, you have to think of a girl one. Should I try it? Oh my gosh. <laughs> um, yeah. Hmm. Yeah, I, I understand the 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 PP size one is kind of a more of a joke joke thing. Um, but there's a there's a lot of interactives. I mean, if you want me to brainstorm some ideas, I could definitely brainstorm some ideas with you. For what um, what what could be used for the bot. I mean, useful stuff. I, I some stuff would be harder to implement than others, but um, you know, kind of the magic eight ball, what you know, thing is 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 a thing that probably could be easy to to do. You would just create a a bunch of different answers, and then it would be random what which answer it would pop up. Possibly, I don't know how the is it similar to like the yes and no questions. Um, would it, or would it work similarly to that? I'm not a dev, so I have no, no clue. <laughs> uh, the, the, the answer, the answer to will this work for you is check mark, of course. <laughs> Ask <Excommation> him point magic. Will this work for you? Oh, ah, cool. So yeah, I think uh, Elizabeth, if you type um, exclamation point commands, it'll tell you everything that uh, Dev Marvel has done. Whoa, my uh, my OBS didn't cut out, did it? I'm still streaming. Yes, okay, I'm still streaming. I I'm freaking out now. I've I've got like put, I've got stress from our stream cut out the other day unexpectedly and it was um just for a moment but it was enough to lose signal Ah, uh, there you go. Commands. And it says, here's all the available commands. So there's a lurk command, which encourages the, encourages the user to lurk and watch the stream. 
uh, IT fuel, which is the current price of Theta fuel. Obviously, it's a cryptocurrency uh, in the U.S. And then, uh, and then the dice. There's a normal dice roll, which is a one d six. It's a six sided die. And then the joke one is the PP size, <laughs> which makes up a size for the user's PP. Which is kind of funny, but but also um, magic gives a yes or no question. Oh, Deb Marvel, are you, are you, yeah, I got uh, jokes would be kind of neat, but that'd be hard to do. Oh, it does. It does do joke. Why don't dinosaurs drive cars? Because they're extinct. <laughs> this is true. Hey, Stephanie, welcome back. How was uh? Did did you finish? Did you finish uh, dinner? As a lover of food, I'm always I'm always into food. I'm into food always. <laughs> you got a quote as well on there now, and a dad joke. Or wait a second, is is it a joke or a dad joke that worked? It was dad joke that worked. Okay. That's awesome, Dev. Like you, you've been busy. Oh, Stephanie Thompson made some Asian chicken stir fry. All right. Sounds delicious. <laughs> so there's a white patch here at the bottom. And I'm going to do something different. I'm going to, you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to grab my, my, my paintbrush if I can find it because my desk is a complete mess. I did put my paintbrush down somewhere. I think it's over here. You ate too much. Oh, no. I'm gonna use that. We're going to use a paintbrush to, to paint in the patch. Add a little bit of water to our thing here. Nice. So yeah, uh, James uh, Thorlick is going to have a bit of a, a, a uh, question on his hands of a <laughs> What was in water? Oh, sweet. Deb Marvel added an uptime to it. So exclamation point uptime, and it actually tells you how long the stream's been running. That's sweet. That's excellent. And then, oh, you got slots on there too. Of course, of course. I mean, that, that makes a lot of sense. <laughs> So when you win on a spin, what what uh, what happens? I guess that's hard to that's hard to predict. And I guess if you're not spending any money, it's not really gambling, is it? Adding a little bit more uh, highlights here. Oh, Elizabeth tried spinning, but she lost. So okay, I'm gonna. So, Dead Marvel, you're gonna obviously write what um, what new commands there are, hey? 
<laughs> Dang. Man. That's impressive. That's super impressive. Guys, go please, please throw him a follow. If you would like to add Babble Chat to your chat, um, link is in actually in the my about section. I've got a, a good link there for you. You can head there um, and do what I didn't do, which was add it as a add Babble Chat, not Babble Bot, not uh, not Babble this, Babble that, bad Babble Chat as a mod. Uh, a 17 hour stream you need a rest dude that's way too long that's way too long holy cow yeah that's that's yikes yes rest rest <laughs> for sure that's some serious grinding i rem you know what I, I i respect it i know i remember doing those those re really really long streams um once in a while is okay, just not not repeatedly. You will burn out and burn out fast. I don't know what it is for everyone else, but for me, like I, uh, the, even a chill stream like this, I end up, I end up like I, it's, I'm using more energy than I normally would, and uh, I'm bagged after the stream. I'm really bagged. I don't know. Maybe it's a, an endorphin thing or um, adrenaline dump. Something like that. That's the gateway. <laughs> the gateway. Oh, yes. The free, the, the gambling with no money. That's free, right? That's the gateway. That's how they get you. Get you hooked. <laughs> Okay, sweet. Getting a four hour sleep, then streaming again for seven days a week. Oh my gosh. It's your real time job. All right. Well, hey, if it's if it's if it's a job, I get it. <laughs> Just um, yeah, do take care of yourself. But I love what you've been up to. I love what you're doing. Fantastic. I'm trying to send as many peeps your way as possible. Okay. So, so we've got a little little patch here. I think there needs to be maybe a change in direction. Um. Just to have it a little bit more random, a little bit more, more, more of a random way that it goes. Maybe we'll have maybe a little bit of black kind of come into that as well. It'd be good. Uh, Trovo link only. What's a Trovo link only? Uh, oh, Julia, uh, what we're talking, I'm talking about, uh, there's people on kick. It's, it's, uh, there's a new bot that's been added to the kick server called Babble Chat. And, um, it's, uh, you know, you know how we used to play the Adventures and Legends game on the channel? Um, now we're seeing a way that we can maybe play it with using dice, the dice command. Um, on kick so but it was ex exclusively to kick oh it's i think elizabeth i think it's dad joke not joke yeah there you go why was the computer cold because it left its windows open <laughs> <laughs> I can't wait for Restream to get involved with Kick, and uh, so we can actually share that in our our chat window here. Um, 
<laughs> uh, there's no guarantee it's going to happen, but I, I have heard from Restream itself saying they've had an enormous amount of requests. Uh, Team Marvel, yes, I'm on Twitch as well. I'm on YouTube, Twitch, Trovo, DLive, and Kick. So for me, cross chat is like essential. I, 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 you know, Kick is the only, right now the only exception. Um, but I know it's it's it's. A, it's new. It's in beta. It's there's a lot of potential for the platform. I'm I'm looking forward to seeing where it goes. Um, but I've always been of the mindset of you know I'm not exclusive to any platform. But uh, all my links and stuff like that are in my about section on 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 every platform. Right? It's all. Whoa! Thank you, thank you so much. Thank you for the follow on Twitch. I love it. I will. I. I. I I'm of the mindset I will hit everybody back. Thank you so much. <laughs> Aww. I appreciate that so much. Thank you. Some little strands and stuff like that there, which is nice. But I want to get, um, I need to take, is it dry enough for me to do it? Though? That's the question. Let's see. Um, no, it's not dry yet. Not dry. I got to wait. I got to wait a little bit. I can't, I can't do it just yet. Uh, you try to get verified on Kick, and your password isn't linking it. Well, the verification on on, like, are you talk are you talking about just verifying your email or? Oh, no problem, I I appreciate that. Thank you. Um, so Julia, are you you're saying just to, so the verification they've actually put in rules now, uh, for the verification. So the way it works is to get affiliated with the platform, you need seventy five followers. And you need five hours streamed. Five hours streamed, no problem. Uh, Seventy-five, you know, it's just a matter of you know, taking the time to to network a bit and and uh, or get your community to come go over there. Um, and then, so after you've been affiliated, then that unlocks monetization, which means you add a sub button. And then, over the course, if you as long as you, I believe it's. So I've heard two stories. It's 50 concurrent viewers or 75 concurrent viewers um, that you need to have to be verified on the platform as a partner for, for a kick. So that'll take a while, but it's something to work towards. You know what? Maybe, you know, you know I'm going to go in. I'm going to go in with a black here. Is there any black left? All dead. Yeah, it's all dead. Okay. I need to get a black pencil now, I think. That's where we're gonna go. Is it sharp enough? I think so. Oh! Who did that? That thinker with a common drop, much love. Thank you so much. Appreciate that. Uh, for those that are on kick, that is D live. That is D live. Uh, that is a donation. Normally what they call lemons. It's a, it's a lemon donation. Uh, nine, I says, I noticed, uh, you had one and I'm over there a lot more. So I wanted to make sure to support it and caught up, your, caught up with your lives. Oh, I'll appreciate that. Like I said, I will, I will, I will hit you back for sure. <laughs> that way you're on my, on my follow list. I'll uh, try to drop by a stream. Oh, 
Okay, I like this. This is this this will allow me to put some some of the the um. It's almost got it's almost got a like windblown look, but it's not it's not necessarily windblown. Uh, so for those that are new here, just to let you know what we do on the channels, I do normally every Wednesday I do two drawings. Uh, one is for uh, a giveaway and the other one is for a way to support the channel. Uh, this particular week, however, uh, we this is um, someone who's gotten me to do their dog. And so one of these drawings is going to them. The one that they don't choose is going to be going to uh, the chat. And the way we do that is Battle Royale style. And what I mean by that is we have a wheel here and anybody that's in the channel um, that we call upon uh, gets, an, uh, gets a chance to win. Um, and for today, we are doing anybody who's on kick gets two entries, not one, two um, to win. So we're going to do that Battle Royale style. And what I mean by Battle Royale style is uh, it's going to be uh, by via... Uh, the wheel, the wheel. I, I see, I bring up the wheel and everybody starts chiming in. <laughs> and we're not there yet, guys. We're not there yet. We've still got a little bit of time left on the drawing. Um, <laughs> so it's better oil style, which means we eliminate, it's an elimination wheel. You do not want your name called until the very end, basically. Um, what it does is it allows me to kind of sh give everybody a shout out. Um, it's an excuse for me to shout out everyone that's, you know, whether they're a sub, whether they're supportive and, and in the stream it allows me to you know just have some fun with it uh it's a great way to you know give thanks to everybody and um and we've i've been doing this every week every wednesday for two years now has it been two years right i think we're on like 170 something drawing <laughs> or whatever that's uh so it's there's been a i've what it's allowed me to do too is get my art out there to a lot of people, which um, which is I'm super thankful for. So, awesome, awesome. All right. So, I try to give my I what I try to do is I try to allocate about two hours of time for each drawing. Um, some drawings tend to go faster than others, which happens. Um, other, other drawings need a little bit more finesse, a little bit more work. Um, but you know, I want to give, I want to give the same amount of attention and detail to, to each, each drawing. Um, some, some drawings are a struggle. Sometimes like I cannot get it to work and it's, it's, you know, that just happens, right? Um, like art and like anything in life, you know, some things turn out better than others. Um, but uh, yeah, that's kind of my that's kind of my thing. I I'd also do gaming streams as well. I do a solo gaming stream and a, a co-op gaming stream. Right now, I'm only able to do about three streams a week uh, just because of um, work and all that kind of stuff. I've got other stuff that I, I can't stream full time. So it's um, that's just uh, but hopefully one day, one day, you know, that's the stream dream, right? <laughs> I mean, this is our hobby. This is our passion. This is our um, our journey, right? All right. I like the way this is coming together. It's coming together quite nice. Um, I do want to put... This is dry enough now that I can work on it. Um, I just wanted to have a little bit more of the hair kind of coming up and around. So art, stuff like that, it's... These are one of a kinds, right? Um... I do have downloads available on my Patreon. Uh, so if you if you want to check out my Patreon, I have different levels. I have a lot of free stuff up there too. It's all, there's stuff for public. So you can go to the Patreon and just simply click the button follow to follow the uh, follow the Patreon and you'll get some stuff every, every so often. Um, but, uh, but there's different tiers and different levels and stuff like that. Other than that, I've got... Um, yeah, James, it's, you're going to have a tough decision. You You're going to... Uh, I'm going to give you time though. You're not going to have to decide right away. Um, I'm going to give you the same time that, uh, that everybody gets, which is 36 hours. You have 36 hours. Once I'm, once I'm done, both of them, and I show them to you, 
You have 36 hours to make a decision. <laughs> and then uh and then the whatever you choose not to will be uh will be given away. We're gonna determine the winner though in just a few moments. Um we've got a little bit of time left. Let's just just a little bit. Just a little bit. Yeah, it's gonna be a tough decision. So the one so what we did earlier, I'll show everybody who's new. We did this one earlier. This is the one that we did previously. So I've got a high, I've got a shining light on it. So it's 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 um but like I said, I've got I've got I've got a I gotta finish this one. That this one has hasn't has much time, so we're uh but we're we're getting very close. I think um within the next uh next 20 minutes we will be uh doing the spinning of the wheel. So again, when I call for it, um, I'm going to be putting a word in the chat. You need to repeat that chat on whatever platform you are on. Again, remember, kick.com counts for not one, but two. Oh, appreciate that. Um, obviously, I'm trying to give kick a little bit of more of a push to try to bring people over to that platform to check it out. Think of it like Twitch, but without ads. <laughs> but it's also, I mean, it's in its beginning stages. So if you're interested in getting in the, in the ground floor on a up, new and up and coming platform, it's one way to do it. And all you need is a valid email, I believe, to start an account. Um, and no, you don't get email spammed or any of that stuff. Okay, here we go. Doing good, doing good. This needs a little bit of finesse here too. Just to separate that. Perfect. A um, little bit more on the nose. How do I? <laughs> you don't, you're happy you don't have to choose? I thought I was going to be torturing Superstar um, last week. But we all know how that went, right? Like that, that, that's, I'm still blown away by that. That was still crazy. So what it was, guys, is that um, Superstar was going to have to choose one, um, one picture to keep. Can't say I blame you. <laughs> Uh, but Superstar proved you that, that it only takes one name, only one name on the wheel to win. So it's not the first time that's happened on the channel. We've had we've had brand new, brand new people on the channel win. We've had, um, you know, it's 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 what it is is I use something called the wheel of names. Uh, the wheel of names is a, a wheel that will spin randomly a certain circumference. And that ratio changes every spin. That was an emotional drawing. Yeah, it was. Yeah. I had a big long hug with Superstar after that stream. Um, for those that don't know, I was drawing my, uh, I was drawing back up my late, uh, late uh, Labrador Retriever, who was with me for twelve years, and um, he was like my kid, really. It. Um, so it was it was a bit of an emotional journey for me. So, but I think I think in a, all all in all an important one. Um, it's made me think a little bit more about um, a possible backup 2.0. <laughs> Terrace twenty three, welcome. Thank you. Appreciate that. Oh, oh, why 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 do I have a follower only chat? Oh, because. On, on Kick right now, I'm trying to gain uh, the ability to become affiliated, right? And so uh, in order to do that, I need to get a certain amount of followers. So um, it's also it's also any bots and stuff like that. Exactly, Comtech will uh, will hit the chat. Um, not that Kick's had too much of a problem so far, but uh, it is the very beginning, right? So but welcome to the stream. 
Uh, I assume, I assume, do you stream on, on kick? All right. Putting in some random, random hairs here. Just to give it a little bit more of a... I don't normally draw right to the edge, but in this case, I kind of did. All right. Cool, cool, cool. <laughs> well, uh, Terrence, if you're ch typing in the chat too, you um, you just did. You 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 followed the channel, and it, it, that that helps me out greatly. Thank you so much. Big 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 appreciation. Um, I do restream, so I'm on a bunch of different platforms at the moment. Um, but it's uh, we're we're trying to put a little push on kick, right? It's an upcoming platform. <laughs> I'll make sure to hit you back too. Um, I usually wait till after the stream and then I will end up following all the all the all the people that came in and bothered to say hi and uh Terrence, if you want to help me more, um you know, all you I I mean all you'd have to do is uh you know hit up my YouTube. It's free. Just subscribe on YouTube. It's just pushing a button. Um that helps out immensely. Uh, also, um, you know, I'm on various different platforms. I, I, I'm of the belief that I want people to be able to pick what platform they want to, to watch the channel on. Um, so that's kind of why I restream and it allows me to connect with a lot more people. It does mean that my, my, um, my viewer base is spread out, which is maybe not the best thing, but you know, I've uh, I've never been exclusive, so. Whoa! Thank you for the hosty host, man. Thank you. Oh, that's sweet of you. He brought over 22 viewers, guys. Thank you so much. <laughs> I wish I had my I wish I had my alert set up for for kick. I really do. Uh, that's coming. That's coming. So welcome to all to the stream, everyone. Um, appreciate you. We're doing a, a <laughs> cute one of the cutest puppies ever, huh? Uh, <laughs> this is Pina. He's a, uh, a terrier mixed with a, um, what was it? A Maltese? Maltese and a, a Shih Tzu mix, right? I think. Appreciate it, guys. I'm trying to get affiliated on, on, on kick. Uh, if you if you could throw me a follow, that would be huge. I wish I had alerts. I wish I, I don't know if they're popping off or not, but um, I definitely appreciate it. Oof, we are we are 15 away from being affiliated because of you guys. Big, big heart, big, big heart. Thank you, guys. Thank you so much. We are we're making our way. I think, you know, it won't be it won't be long now that we uh, We'll actually get our aff affiliation button with kick. I <laughs> uh, appreciate it. I know, I know art streams and stuff like that are not like the big, big deal. That's not, but I do do a little bit of gambling. And part of that gambling is with what we call uh, the wheel. Um, so my wheel here. Oh, wow. Stephanie throwing down the gauntlet. So. I do a little bit of gambling here on, on, on kick. Now the gambling is basically trying to figure out. So we've got two drawings here <laughs> Two draw. I know I can't display both of them at once. This is silly, right? I wonder, can I, no, I can't. <laughs> Have it peeking out like that. So funny. So funny. Um, We've <laughs> so what it is is that I've got a bunch of names here. What what these names are? He's like, where's my chat? <laughs> no worries, man. Don't worry. Listen, I, I don't know how long you were streaming for. Maybe it's everyone's like, I need to go to the bathroom. <laughs> it's all good. Um, so all these names that are listed here, these are names are of uh, subscribers from various different platforms. 
um, and or Patreon members who uh, have signed up for Patreon and get automatic entries to win. However, I always, and I have from the very beginning, always, always asked for people to say a secret word in chat and they get added to the wheel. So we're going to do that again today. Um, we're going to put a word in chat. I'm going to add more people to the wheel. Anybody who's on kick, it counts twice. Now, here's the thing. I have the rules are, are, are in such that there's basically three rules. Uh, number one, you need to be 18 years or older, right? To, to or, or at least get your parents' permission. Um, number two, you have 36 hours to get back to me after you've won. Um, and that can be done via my email or through my Discord or through Twitter. Um, just get in contact with me. And then what we do, what you do is you, you tell me your name, what you won, give me, uh, and you have to be willing to give me a, an address for me to be able to send the drawing to. The address uh, could be an office, it could be a neighbor, it could be, it's just something that you have access to. If you're not comfortable, still not comfortable giving it out an address, I respect it, I totally understand that. I offer a high res digital copy instead, which can be sent um, to you through email or through, um, well, yeah, it has to be through email or Discord. Those are the only two options. Um, boom, That's that. those are like, those are the ground rules uh, for the giveaway. It is 100% a giveaway. Um, the, 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 the secret word, I mean, we'll just say the dog's name, right? Let's just do that. So uh, all you guys have to do is put Pina in chat. So Pina, that's P-I-N-A. You don't have to worry about the accent. Um, and I will add you to the wheel. Uh, again, counts double on kick. What this happened? Uh, Stephanie Thompson said, if I'm do I'm donating to James Thorlickson, who commissioned the drawing, if she wins. That's insane. So, James, you've got more chances to win, that means. <laughs> okay. Uh, we got Nine Eyes, the first one to put Pina in on Twitch. All right. So I'm going to add you to the wheel. Is it Nine Eye? Nine Eye? Nine Eye 87. Aw. All right. We got Elizabeth on 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 kick. Awesome. We'll get Elizabeth up there. It counts for two. There we go. Two for Elizabeth. Uh, we've got my my Mystic Angel Christina. I almost said Mystic Anal, but I didn't. I didn't say Mystic Anal. I said Mystic Angel. But then I did say, okay, never mind. Uh, that counts for two. <laughs> All right. Uh, let's go raid right on you. <laughs> Much love. Okay, let me get back to, let me get back to, we got Stephanie Thompson. Stephanie Thompson on YouTube. We'll add Stephanie Thompson to the wheel. There we go. Perfect. All right. Who else? We got Julianne. Julianne on the YouTubes. All right. Julia, are you not able to access kick? You were saying you, you, you were having some trouble or something like that. Haha. <laughs> Do, <laughs> do. Ow. Okay. So let me. Uh, we're gonna we're gonna change up the music. We're gonna get a little bit more hype music going on. I think would be good. Give me a second. All right. Let me see. Oh, you can't get on. Oh, you might as well just make a new account. <laughs> make a new account. Just all you need is an email, right? Um, let me, where's my music? Hold up. Sorry, guys.
No, that's not the one I want. That's not the one I want. My bad. Oh, there you go. We got, we got, we got, uh, we got Pina. We got James Thorlix in, in there. You might, uh, you might want to get, um, what was it? MMS involved as well. Is it's another chance to win? Sorry, guys. I, I should be playing music. And why is this not copying? Hold on. Try it again. Oop. There we go. Got it. Um, oh, yeah. Music. Music. I need music. What the heck? It's dead silence. This is not good. Dead silence. Where's my playlist? Urgh. Hold on. Where's my music for stream? Um, okay. Crazy. All right. Um, there it is. I found it. I found it. Sorry about that, guys. Sorry about that. Let me grab, let me grab uh, some more hype music and we'll get into the uh, MMS. All right. Perfect. Did I miss it earlier? I'm so sorry. My bad. All right, let's get some hype music going on. Come on. I, I, let's, 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 let's get it going. All right, here we go. Is that the one I want? You want to put Kalida after her name? Pina Kalada. Oh, what a great second dog. You guys got to get Kalada now, guys. <laughs> uh, Death Thinker. Death Thinker. You got you to gotta put in Pina. Uh, not yet, Death Thinker. We're not using Restream just yet, but I've talked to Restream, and they are very, very interested in Kick right now. So... There might be some good things coming in the, in the near future, um, which I'm excited about. But it's not a done deal, right? So we'll, 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 we'll have to wait and see. <laughs> it's a good drink, indeed. Then you got to get a, a third dog named Rum. <laughs> All right. Uh, oh, one more thing, guys. We need to roll a dice. And what better way than to do that on kick, shall we? Let's roll a dice to find out how many times we need to shuffle the deck. Oh, Death Thinker just got a late entry. Okay, hold on. All right, let me, um, let's roll 20 on kick. I rolled a one. <laughs> I rolled a one. Oh gosh, we're not, we're, okay, we're gonna, we're gonna do it in, for each drawing. <laughs> we're gonna roll, let's roll again. There's no reroll command. I rolled a nine. Okay, ten. It's ten. All right, fair enough. Holy crap. Nene just rolled a critical hit. A 20. A 20. Can you... Holy crap, guys. Amazing. <laughs> okay, so let's... um Let's... We're going to spin it ten times. And we're going to do, um, do, 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 do. What, what am I doing? I got to add Death Thinker. Death Thinker is the last, last entry. So let me just add Death Thinker before we shuffle the deck. And then it's official. Sorry about that. I'm Space Cadet. All right. It's official. It's over. No, no late entries anymore. Let's go. We're going to shuffle the deck. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. There we go. All right, guys. This gives me an opportunity to shut you guys out. Thank you guys so bloody much for being here. Um, there can only be one winner, though. So we're going to have to uh, spin spin the wheel, so to speak, right? 
All right. Ooh, here we freaking go. First one eliminated from the wheel. Or one of the names limited, limited from the wheel. I want a big shout out to Elizabeth Flood, who's usually always here at the very, very beginning of the stream and it always sticks to the end. And I appreciate you so bloody much. Let me just, let me remove the one name. You do have more entries to win. Good luck to everybody. Oh, oh my gosh. It went right by MMS and went right into Elizabeth 1975. Thank you for your sub on, was it Twitch or Trova? I can't remember. Let me, let me, let me, rem let me spin the wheel. Good luck, everyone. <laughs> we got Mythic Russ. Mythic Russ is a global partner on DLive. Mythic Russ, big shout out to you, my friend. He uh, just told me that he recently received not one, but two drawings uh, in the Netherlands. No, in Wales. He's in Wales. Why did I say Netherlands? I have no idea. I, I'm, I'm not drunk. Okay, let me um let me spin the wheel. Let's go. We've got the lovely Julianne. Julianne. Much love. That is only one name removed. You still have a chance to win. We're gonna spin that wheel. With this battle royale style. We gotta get we gotta get we gotta get through these. I cannot forget Mystic Angel Christina. She um She's been a huge supporter of the channel, not just on, here, here on the channel, but also on Patreon. Big, big much love to you. Thank you so much. That's one name. We're going to keep going, though. <laughs> oh, who is it? Is it? Oh, we got one from Death Thicker. Death Thicker, that is not your only entry. You're a sub here on DLive. You uh, ha have already an automatic entry, so... You're not gone yet. I didn't know drunk was an option. <laughs> Have you been to a Sea of Thieves stream of mine? <laughs> Elizabeth! Oh my gosh, Elizabeth got hit again, guys. But she's not she's not out. She's not out. I appreciate you guys so much. Appreciate I pre I appreciate I appreciate you so much. Oh my god. I can't even talk. Elizabeth has been getting hit hard today, guys. But you know what? It's because we have hard love for her. Much love, Elizabeth. No, no it's, it's the last person on the wheel, guys. The last person on the wheel. That's right. It's Battle Royale style. There can only be one. It's Highlander style. We get down to one winner. That's right. So you do not want your name coming up until the very, very end. Blood Hooligan. Big love to Blood Hooligan. Recently, actually, just the past couple weeks has been uh, coming by the channel. And I uh, appreciate you, man. Thank you so much for your, for your, for your patronage. So, so much for your, your sub. What's up, man? I think he's been eliminated, though. I think that was the only one. Oh, okay. Oof. Stephanie Thompson got hit. Okay, Stephanie, uh, you still have chance, more chances to win. And I, I guess she's 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 hoping to get it for... Uh, for for James Thorlickson as well, so he doesn't have to choose. That's cheating. <laughs> oh, we got Marco, 258. Marco, much love for you. I believe Marco was on Trovo. Much love, much love to you, man. We we keep we keep it going though. We keep it going. Ah, uh, you see now. Nine Nine's picking it up. She's picking it up. She's got it. She's like, oh, I see how this works. We got Linz and John Paranormal. Um Big, big, big helper on Patreon. And uh, she, she's in the UK, so some, it's like super late right now for her. It's like two in the morning. Uh, but much love, Linz. Appreciate you. She's not, she's also the boss to beat, I think. Actually, not so anymore. With Mystic getting um, double on uh, kick, she's like equal with her, I think. Stephanie, no, Stephanie got hit. Oh. Oh, yeah, yeah, because it says, well, the wheel just says we have a winner. Yes, oh, you guys are all winners in my heart. Like, let's be real here. You guys, it, it's speaking truth here. 
You guys are amazing. <laughs> but there's only one person that's going to win the prize. But you're all winners in my book. Ah, we got Comtech. Comtech was here in the chat. Comtech. Wait a second. Comtech didn't, didn't enter, did he? He saw the wheel at the first time. He was like, oh, it's time. <laughs> nope. Much love, Comtech. Well, I'm sailing with him tomorrow for a Sea of Thieves stream. Uh, there might be some drinking involved. There's definitely going to be some booty involved um, and some good times. So I hope, hopefully you'll be able to join us for that. That should be about 7.30 p.m. PST time. Elizabeth. Oh, gosh. Elizabeth came up again. You have enough names on the wheel? You feel all oh, you bastard. <laughs> There's never enough. There's never enough. <laughs> Contact much love, man. Mr. Badass. Oh, Mr. Badass. As I like to call him, uh, Naughty Bum. He's Mr. Naughty Bum to me. <laughs> much love. He's going for his GP on uh, DLive. Oh, no. Oh, shoot. Death Thinker. I think that was your last one, though. Oh. Unfortunately, I have to remove you, but you're a winner in my heart. Thank you so much, man. Appreciate it so, so much. Let's let's keep spinning. Oh, crap. Comtech. <laughs> You spoke in chat, and that's what happens. Your name starts coming up more often. <laughs> Much love, Comtech. We got to figure out whose who's ship we're taking tomorrow. No, he says. Uh-oh. Stephanie, uh-oh. That doesn't look good. Stephanie, no! Guys, I, I want to say thank, thank you for being here on Kick and stuff like that. I, I really appreciate it. It's, um, who's rolling 20s? <laughs> oh, no, I scrolled up. My, my, my bad. Well, speaking of Sea of Thieves, we got MD Wit. MD Wit is always uh, a welcome uh, member of our, our ship crew. However, her, her, her controller sometimes doesn't work. Last time she had to cut out early, which was a shame. And we missed her dearly, dearly. Uh, did I hear something about... Speaking of MD Witch, she's in the D-Live chat right now. Did I hear something about booty? Yes, you did. Hail all. Much love, MD. Your name just came up for the first time on the wheel. You got a new controller? Hell yes. Let's freaking go. <laughs> let's go. Oh, oh, oh. Is it Russ or is it Lens? It is Russ. Russ, you got to take a bus. You're out of here. Bye-bye, Russ. <laughs> much love, Russ. <laughs> Thank you so much. Let's go. Hey, we got Karaoke Ken. Karaoke Ken in the house. He does uh, karaoke streams and music streams on DLive. He's a verified partner there. Much love to Ken. Oh, oh no, no, it's gonna, oh my gosh. It doesn't matter who it hits. It's, it's, Stephanie got hit, took the bullet for James. It was, oh, it was so close to James getting hit too. We spin it. Do you feel like you're gambling? Do you feel like it's, 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 it's happening? Oh, is it Lens? It's Lens, it's Lens, it's Lens. No, it's Viper kills. Viper got killed. Bye-bye Viper. <laughs> Much love, man. <laughs> All right. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. MMS just got hit. MMS. Unfortunately, that is your last entry. Much love to you. I hope, I hope, uh, I hope. I guess it's James or Stephanie. It gets it for you. We'll see. We got... Mystic Angel Christina. Big, big shout out to her. <laughs> I've done a shout out. I mean, some, some people get multiple shout outs. It's true. <laughs> MD with 60. Oh, dear. Okay. MD, you're not out. You're not out. You still have another entry, I believe. How are you doing? I hope you had a good... Hopefully... 
good good work day and you're able to relax now. We got Elizabeth. Woo! Elizabeth. Is that you're still on the wheel, Elizabeth, believe it or not. Wow my gosh. You're going in your corner now. Don't go to your corner. Oh! Oh, nay nay. Nay nay noy. Pablo's like, I'm not here. <laughs> Uh, Nene, thank you so much. I honestly, I really appreciate you joining me on the channel on Kick. I really appreciate you joining joining the Twitch as well. I look forward to seeing you, seeing you or a stream in the future on on Twitch or Kick. Much love. I was, I, I appreciate you so much. Thank you, thank you. I, again, it is, it is the Shuffle of Deck. We do this every Wednesday. Every Wednesday we do it. Um, and of course I have m more more ways to uh to get involved much love take care <laughs> or you if you were dying to see who's gonna win stay tuned sometimes sometimes you never know who's gonna win uh but who's not gonna win is julia ann i'm so sorry julia i think that was your last one uh big hugs big hugs pablo how you doing man night was better Night was bet. Wait, what? Oh, slider 1611. Sliding on in and sliding on out. Uh, she said that day's like, oh, I'm staying. <laughs> okay. <laughs> no problem. We're going to find out who's going to win. <laughs> oh, shoot balls. What we. Oh, James. James Tholikson. It. It's not looking good. It's not looking good. It's looking like you might have to choose. You didn't pull a superstar. Only superstar can pull that off. <laughs> Apparently. I don't know how she did it last week. Oh my gosh. And you're like your backup. Your backup. Stephanie. Again, this is Stephanie uh, Thompson with her sub on Twitch. Thank you so much. Retired veteran. Thank you for your service. Unfortunately, it was not meant to be today. Holy crap, Julia just found found it. She's actually in on the chat. Hey, Julian, you forgot your J in your name. Um <laughs> that's Oh uh, yeah, that's is that it for Steph? That is it for Steph. Ah, uh, Stephanie, so much love. Uh Stephanie also has been like Stephanie has has usually comes in at the very beginning of the stream and stays till the end. And I cannot thank you enough for that. Uh, furthermore. When you when you do like tune, turn in early, you go back and you watch what you missed, and I I like uh, my heart goes out to you. Thank you so much. Uh, just even your watch time is is huge support, and yeah, I it's uh, I've been able to get to know you a little bit more as as these streams have gone on, and it's been it's been wonderful. So I want to wish say thank you, but I gotta keep spinning the wheel. <laughs> I gotta I gotta keep it moving. Everyone's like. Yeah. Keep going, keep going. Linz and John Paranormal. Uh, we have to remove one of your names. We're gonna keep spinning. She's got many on here, guys. <laughs> Let me, like, speaking of which, there she is again. That's not good for her, but it's great for you guys. All right. Let's let's give it work down down to Sweet 16. There are 16 names up on the wheel. Let's keep spinning. Let's find out. The J is silent. <laughs> yeah, I think after a month you can change your name. Let's, ooh, Lynn's got hit again. Wow, this is great for you guys. I was, I honestly thought, like, clearly I thought Lynn's was going to get a majority of the drawings every week because of her level on Patreon. But it's actually, you know what? It's, it is still a luck of the draw. Pablo says, if I win, I want James to have it. Oh my gosh, you know how close it was to Pablo getting hit? <laughs> but Mystic, big shout out to you. Honestly, like when I'm speaking of, of, of people that support the channel, you have been supportive on every, like like a, a majority of the platforms, whether it's, uh, what is it? Twitch, DLive. Yeah, thank you so much. But I have to remove your name. <laughs> let me, let me, 
This is painful. You guys know how painful this is for me every week. Oh, man. Elizabeth, I think that might be all she wrote. I think that was the last one. I'm so sorry. Yeah, it was the last one. Shoot. Okay. So we're down to the Baker's Dozen, the final 13. Uh, I will do a call out on the final 10. How about, right? Get down to 10, the final 10 that have survived all this time in the battle royale of, of games. Gamer Cam, you're a shooter. You, you, you join me on my co-op streams every other week. Unfortunately, I have to remove you. <laughs> too close, too close to call. All right. The actual dozen, not the baker's dozen. The actual dozen. Let's find out what it is. Oh, it's MD Wit. MD Wit got hit. Ah, uh, MD's like cursing, going, dang, dang it. I haven't won on, on the wheel. Like, and, wait, didn't you win? Like, you won recently, didn't you? I, I'll, have to check, I'll have to check the winner's list. I do have it all in my about section, guys. There is a winner's list down there. You can click that. It'll list all the winners that have won throughout these past two years. Um, it actually has a little picture of what they won too. But uh, And then if you're looking to purchase art, I do have a section there that's stuff that's available. These are sketches that have been on the, on the channel. Um, anyway, let's keep spinning. We got 11 names, 11 lucky possible winners. All winners in my book, but, but, Lens, Lens got hit again. All right. Final 10. Let's do a tally here. We've got Pablo Escanaba. We got Renzo Scriber. We got Mystic Angel Christina with three po- No, excuse me. Four possible chances. We got Linz and John Paranormal with two possible chances. We've got Comtech. And we've got Doogie. So odds are in, in Mystic Angel's favor right now. She's got, she's got the most chances to win. <laughs> Guys, also, feel free to follow each other in, in, in the kick chat, too. Everyone's trying to work towards those affiliates and uh, verified. So definitely give it every... If you see a name, go give them a follow. All right. Doogie, 1872. Odds mean nothing. On Solo said, never tell me the odds. Doogie! I appreciate you, man, but you are gone. You are eliminated. Let's keep spinning. It's too close to call. You never know. You never know what's going to happen. Oh, shoot. Pablo! Pablo! Pablo did the, the thing where he spoke in chat, and boom, what do you know? His name pops up. Uh, appreciate you, man. All right, we're going to... Uh, just, just got to rip the band-aid off. We're going to rip that band-aid. Who's, who's it coming down to? Oh my gosh. Mystic is dodging everything. Instead, Linz and John Paranormal takes the bullet. Takes the bullet. Mystic is dodged every single thing so far. Oh my gosh. This is a, this is a landslide win. Possibly. Comtech got eliminated. Wahaha. Okay. Oh my gosh, finally, Mystic loses one chance. All right. So now she's got how many? One, two, three chances. Linz and John Paranormal has one chance and Renzo Scriber, who has never won on the channel before, is on the wheel at the, at the final five. The final five, guys. Okay, here we go. Yeah, def definitely follow each other, guys. It, it really helps in the long run. It really, really helps. Your Honor, I was wrong about odds. Perhaps <laughs> it's too late to say that after you get hit by an asteroid. All right, Mystic Angel Christina. Ah, oh, your odds are, are uh, it's getting weaker. We have two chances to win with Mystic Angel. One chance to win with Lens. One chance to win with Renzo Scriber. It's the final four. All and, and in celebration of Women's International Day, all four winners here are women. I don't know how that happens, but it happens. <laughs> four ladies. All right. Well, three ladies. 
one counts for two, I guess. Okay, let's let's spin it. Oh my gosh. Of course it's gonna come down to a fair fight. Holy cow. Alright. We have three lovely, lovely women's. That's right, women's. What are they? Uh women? Uh women are a type of man. <laughs> They're a woman. No, no, that's not right. Women are superior. They can give birth. They have wombs. Uh, that's, that's, yeah, that's what my wife told me to say. All right, let me spin it. Let me spin it. Oh my gosh. I'm defying all odds. I cannot believe it. Holy crap. Mystic Angel, you, you were, you were definitely in, <laughs> like that, that is, oh, wow. Okay, it wasn't meant to be. That's all that's got to mean. We've got Linz and John Paranormal, and we've got Renzo Scriber. And it's right down the middle. It's right down the middle. Okay. So Linz versus Renzo. Let's go. Holy crap! Linz and John Paranormal gotten eliminated. Holy crap! First time ever to win a drawing on the channel, Renzo Scriber. Can you freaking believe it? Holy crap, guys. She's been wanting, it's funny enough, she's been wanting a dragon for the longest time. And <laughs> she's not getting a dragon. She's going to be getting a dog <laughs> instead. <laughs> wow. Renzo Scriber won. I can't believe it. It's finally happened. We've been saying this like month after month, <laughs> week after week. She's never, ever won. Congratulations. Congratulations, Renzo. I will let her know in the um, in the chat. And again, she's going to get whatever uh, whatever James chooses not to have. Right. So I'm going to send I'm going to take a picture. I'm going to send it to uh, to James. He's going to be able to decide. Um, he's got he'll have 36 hours after that point in time. And then he'll let me know. And then, and then I will, of course, let Renzo know um, as soon as she's won um, and what she's won. All that. That made you pee hard. <laughs> um, Pablo, what are you doing? <laughs> My goodness, let me take off the wheel. Let me let me, uh, let me take that off. Let's display these. Display these out like that. Yeah, that comes out nice. I, I tested out the the clip feature on on Kick. There, I think it takes really long time to do a clip, doesn't it? Oh, wow. Julian, you, you put the link to the spreadsheet for the winner's list? Thank you. On kick. Sorry, guys. Um, it's been really difficult, actually, looking at both chats. But it, you know what? I, I want to get that integrated. If, if by chance, uh, Restream never does it, I will figure out a new way to display um, in the overlay. I think that's, that, you know. But there's hope. There's hope that Restream is going to go out going to be included, uh, or sorry, kick's going to be included in Restream, um, and that will make my life a lot easier. Uh, you'll take the number second one. Okay. I Sure thing. I So what's the first one? This is the first one, this is the second? Or is it the other way around? Is it... See, now I just switched it on you, didn't I? Okay. Let's say this was the first one that was drawn, and this was the second. That's number one. That's number two. Uh, put a number in chat. Which one did you want? <laughs> Aw, Julia, you're you're the best. I gotta I gotta wait for for. So this is number one. This is number two. I I have a feeling he's gonna say this one, but I'm not sure. Okay, just waiting for for James. Um, let me let me. Uh, you know what? I'll confirm. I'll confirm. Number two, number two. I'll confirm with him via via email. Uh, not a problem, guys. Yes, number two. Okay. 
Perfect. Perfect. You got it, my friend. Um, I just want to take a moment here just to say thank you. Thank you, guys. I, 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 I find that I get uplifted by you guys uh, when I stream. I tend to really, I don't know what it is, but it's just, there's some magic happening with you guys. And I just, it makes me feel good. And I just want to say thank you. Um, all the new people that have come by the stream today. That's, that's amazing. It's so great to meet new people. It really is. Um, if again, kick.com is a new platform. Um, I recommend checking it out. I reckon, you know, you never know. You, you might end up liking it more. Um, I think a lot of the stuff is really cool there. Thank you guys so much. Uh, MD went with a rare drop on DLive. Thank you so much, MD. I look for We're sailing tomorrow. You better get some sleep. <laughs> I'm glad you got a new controller. It's good. That's right. We have a Sea of Thieves stream tomorrow at 7.30, 7.30 uh, p.m. PST. Uh, we're going to be sailing and doing something maybe we have never done before. You never know what's going to happen on a sea, 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 sea of Thieves stream. It, um, but it's a fun time for all. Thank you guys so much. Okay. That about wraps up my stream. That's, that's, uh, uh if, uh, Nene says, you guys are awesome. And thank you so much for the stream officer. Oh, thank you so much, Nene. Um, Nai Nai. Is it Nai Nai or Nene? It's Nai. Nai. Nai Nai, right? Nail Nail? No, Nai Nai. Nai Nai. <laughs> um, excuse me. All right. Uh, just, <laughs> MD just wanted to take my crown, bitch. What? Pablo. What? What do you mean? Oh, for like, oh yes, okay. That is true. I should sh uh, shout out everybody on the uh, on the stream today. Um, thank you for the donos. Appreciate that. Again, if you want your pet featured on the channel, get in contact with me. Send me an email. Shoot me a Discord message. Shoot me a message on Twitch or uh, Twitter. And, um, you know, maybe arrange something for next week. You never know. Right on, guys. That's it for me. I love you guys. Thank you guys so much. I will catch you guys on the next one. May all your hits be criticals and your adventures be legendary. I will catch you guys on the next one. Take care.